friends, a gentle reminder about our Bible study, which will happen immediately after the rosary from 5.30 to 6.30 p.m. every day. Please do join us and be blessed. We will begin the intercession for the prayer of deliverance by Pope Leo XIII. Kindly keep the holy water by your side, which we will use immediately after the end of this deliverance prayer. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ, our God and Lord, strengthened by the intercession of the Immaculate Virgin Mary, Mother of God, of Blessed Saint Michael the Archangel, of the Blessed Apostles Peter and Paul, and all the saints, we confidently undertake to repulse the attacks and deceits of the devil. God arises, his enemies are scattered, and those who hate him flee before him. As smoke is driven away, so are they driven, as wax melts before the fire, so the wicked perish at the presence of God. Behold the cross of the Lord, flee bands of enemies. He has conquered the lion of the tribe of Judah, the offspring of David. May your mercy, Lord, descend upon us, as great as our hope in you. Let us pray. We will make the sign of the cross wherever we see the cross on our screen. We drive you from us, whoever you may be, every unclean spirit, all satanic powers, all infernal invaders, all wicked legions and assemblies and sects. In the name and by the power of our Lord Jesus Christ, may you be snatched away and driven from the church of God and from the souls made to the image and likeness of God and redeemed by the precious blood of the divine Lamb. Most cunning serpent, you shall no more dare to deceive the human race, persecute the church, torment God's elect, and sift them as wheat. The Most High God commands you, he with whom in your great insolence you still claim to be equal, he who wants all men to be saved and to come to the knowledge of the truth. God the Father commands you, God the Son commands you, God the Holy Spirit commands you, Christ, God's Word made flesh, commands you, he who to save our race outdone through your envy humbled himself becoming obedient even unto death he who has built his church on the firm rock and declared that the gates of hell shall not prevail against her because he will dwell with her all days even to the end of the world the sacred sign of the cross commands you as does also the power of the mysteries of the christian faith the glorious mother of god the virgin mary commands you she who by her humility and from the first moment of her immaculate conception crushed your proud head the faith of the holy apostles peter and paul and of the other apostles commands you the blood of the martyrs and the pious intercession of all the saints commands you thus cursed dragon and you diabolical legions we adjure you by the living god by the true god by the holy god by the god who so loved the world that he gave up his only son that every soul believing in him might not perish but have life everlasting stop deceiving human creatures and pouring out to them the poison of eternal damnation stop harming the church and hindering her liberty begone satan inventor and master of all deceit enemy of man's salvation give place to christ in whom you have found none of your works give place to the one holy catholic and apostolic church acquired by christ at the price of his blood stoop beneath the all-powerful hand of god tremble and flee when we invoke the holy and awesome name of jesus this name which causes hell to tremble this name to which the virtues powers and dominations of heaven are humbly submissive this name which the cherubim and seraphim praise unceasingly repeating holy 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 is the lord the god of armies O Lord, hear our prayer and let our cry come unto you. May the Lord be with you and with your spirit. Let us pray. God of heaven, God of earth, God of angels, God of archangels, God of patriarchs, God of prophets, God of apostles, God of martyrs, God of confessors, God of virgins, God who has power to give life after death and rest after work, because there is no other God than you, and there can be no other. For you are the creator of all things, visible and invisible, of whose reign there shall be no end. We humbly prostrate ourselves before your glorious majesty, 
and we beseech you to deliver us by your power from all the tyranny of the infernal spirits, from their snares, their lies, and their furious wickedness. They know, Lord, to grant us your powerful protection and to keep us safe and sound. We beseech you through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. From the snares of the devil, deliver us, O Lord, that your church may serve you in peace and liberty. We beseech you to hear us, that you may crush down all the enemies of your church. We beseech you to hear us. Amen. We will all use the holy water and bless ourselves. Saint Michael, the Archangel, defend us in the day of battle. Be our safeguard against the wickedness and the snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray, and do thou, O Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the power of God, cast into hell, Satan and all other evil spirits who prowl through the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. Mary, Queen of all saints, pray for us. Prayer to Saint Joseph. Hail, Guardian of the Redeemer, Spouse of the Blessed Virgin Mary, to you God entrusted his only Son. In you Mary placed her trust. With you Christ became man. Blessed Joseph, to us too, show yourself a Father and guide us in the path of life. Obtain for us grace, mercy and courage and defend us from every evil. Amen. Friends, today we are going to pray that God gives us the wisdom and the understanding to understand how God answers our prayers. The Word of God very beautifully says that my thoughts are not your thoughts, my ways are not your ways. And oftentimes we pray and pray and pray and our, and our prayers are answered. But it may not be at the time that we want or in the way that we want but at the time and in the way that god knows it is good for us so together we are going to pray this matthew 21 22 because we know of so many people world around who are who are feeling helpless and hopeless and they feel that even if i pray nothing is going to happen we're going to pray on behalf of all of humanity who thinks that nothing is going to happen even if I go to God. There are people who think that their fate is written out and nothing is going to change for their lives. But today as we speak out this word from Matthew 21, 22, let us believe that the power of the Holy Spirit will work in those lives where their, their, their souls are parched and they feel desperate and hopeless believing firmly that nothing is going to change in their lives let us declare this word together with faith on behalf of all those who are struggling in their prayer life in their faith life matthew 21 22 if you believe you will receive whatever you ask for in prayer amen matthew 21 22 if you believe you will receive whatever you ask for in prayer. Amen. Matthew 21, 22. If you believe, you will receive whatever you ask for in prayer. Amen. Matthew 21, 22. If you believe, you will receive whatever you ask for in prayer. Amen. Matthew 21, 22. If you believe, you will receive whatever you ask for in prayer. Matthew 21, 22. If you believe, you will receive whatever you ask for in prayer. Amen. Matthew 21, 22. If you believe, you will receive whatever you ask for in prayer. Today, all our intentions have been offered in Holy Mass. I was offered by Father Rausepichin Nedubram. Let us pray very specially for Father, that Father may be assisted with divine intervention all throughout his life, that he may experience a powerful anointing 
and that God may bless him with excellent health and long life to spread God's love and the good news. Amen. Today's rosary is being led by a family, by Rinu, Lisa, Rihanna, and Rina. Let us begin the rosary in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth. I believe in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord. He was conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit and born of the Virgin Mary. He suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended to death. On the third day, he rose again. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. He will come again to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into the temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Holy Mary, daughter of eternal Father, strengthen our faith. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of the beloved Son, increase our hope. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, radiant temple of the Holy Spirit, deepen our love. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, the world without end. Amen. The first glorious mystery, the resurrection of our Lord Jesus, we are going to pray very specially for struggling marriages. The first few days of courtship and maybe marriage, once it's over, and all those fuzzy, warm emotions are no more experienced by couples, they suddenly wonder what have they gotten themselves into. Maybe they begin to see monstrous behaviors of the other, insensitivity, dreams shattering, hearts breaking, some even regretting the decision to get married to, this, to the other person. They may find themselves in a mess that they never thought of seeing themselves in. But friends, all of us together, we're going to believe that whatever we have prayed for in faith, we will receive it and we're going to thank God for giving couples this grace to bloom where they are planted and to help them see, see through the bad experiences or the bad behaviors or even worse attitudes and values that they, that they see. Knowing that all of these are opportunities to grow as human beings. Maybe there is great purging, but this is that great purging that we go through here on earth to sanctify our souls. Together, friends, let us pray and thank God for giving couples, especially those who are struggling in this area, the grace to understand and to go beyond what they can see and hear and experience in their marriage and to, and to stretch out themselves to love as Jesus has loved. We thank God for this grace. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed by the name, the kingdom come, they will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Do not lead us into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of your own Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst men, and blessed is the fruit of your own Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst men, and blessed is the fruit of your own Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, 
Pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, the world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. And lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of your mercy. Amen. Mary, Queen of the Most Holy Rosary, pray, pray for us. The second glorious mystery, the ascension of our Lord Jesus, we pray for families. The grass always seems greener on the other side, especially in somebody else's home, in somebody else's family. Maybe that family looks so close to perfection. The other husband and wife, they have so much of love and understanding. The other family has a beautiful house, much like my taste. The other family have children who are so obedient, so prayerful and spiritual. Or maybe we've heard ourselves say her husband does not drink and he goes to church every day. His wife does not nag and is so respectful and understanding. We've all seen other children doing so well in their academics, older children who are well-placed with high paying jobs. But the truth is that every family has a demon that they encounter every day, every day, which has been allowed in God's wisdom. He is not the source of it, but he has been, a, the demon has been allowed to enter into our lives to make us stronger and to make us beautiful. The Lord always gives us everyday practical lessons of how to wield the word and to be victorious in our lives. For instance, if we are learning about agape love, then he gives us those opportunities in our lives that may seem extremely painful and some of it may be unbearable, but he always gives us those practical lessons. Without a test, there's really no victory. There, there is really no winning. There is really no promotion. If we have prayed for the grace to never complain and to be grateful in our lives, God always gives us the opportunities. He allows mistakes. He will allow mismatches. He will allow imperfection. He will allow delays in order to answer our many prayers, to make us this beautiful and sanctified person that he originally designed us to be. And the more that we realize this, that all the pain and the purging that God allows into our life is to, is to really make us that beautiful, sanctified person. We will receive everything that life throws at us with great strength, with great courage, and with great love. We thank God for giving families world over this grace to understand that their, that their prayers are never going unanswered, but God answers them in the way that he knows that is best for us. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. 
and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. As, As it was in the beginning, it now shall be, world is out and Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of your mercy. Amen. Mary, Queen of the Most Holy Rosary, pray for us. The third glorious mystery, the descent of the Holy Spirit, we pray very specially for children. When we pray for children, I'm sure many of us have heard this story about this little boy who, who loved his caterpillar and he fed the caterpillar and he soon found that the caterpillar forming a cocoon and a little while later he saw how the cocoon um, there was a small hole in it and a little butterfly that was growing that was trying to come out of it and so this little boy wanting to help the butterfly runs to get his scissors and and cuts the cocoon for the butterfly to come out I'm sure many of us have heard this story so many times and we have heard how this butterfly fell out, fell off, was never able to fly ever in, in his life. The butterfly was meant to struggle and to come out and by which the fluid from its body would go into its wings that would, that would help him to, to fly. I remember a young child, now of course uh, an adult, who had a very difficult, very painful childhood. And he shared, as a child, I could never come to terms with all that happened in my life. I was always very insecure and sad. But as I grew up and I drew close to Jesus, I found new meaning to all the struggles that I went through in my childhood. And he says how today he can understand people so beautifully. He he counsels people who have been through trauma and he does therapy for them and he is used as a very powerful instrument of god god built him up with great inner strength with wisdom with resilience love and understanding it truly was an answer to the prayer but maybe as parents what we would do is normally not allow our children to go through any kind of struggles we fulfill all of their desires and their wishes immediately. Let us examine and see, are we standing to allow God to answer the prayers of our children, including our own prayers for them? 
or are we standing in the way of God and our children? We thank God for enabling parents and for enabling parents with great love to nurture children and to allow them to see how God answers both the parents and the children's prayer. Amen. Our Father in heaven, holy be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done. On earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, of thy womb Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, the world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of your mercy. Mary, Queen of the Most Holy Rosary, pray for us. The fourth glorious mystery, the Assumption of Mother Mary. We pray for the Church and for holy vocations. Maybe some of us are joining this rosary every day because we have we have a problem that we want to overcome or maybe we want to use our time and also our devotion to be a blessing to someone else who is in need or who may not be able to pray. Somewhere we are deeply devoted and we want to make spiritual progress. But the truth is if we want to experience this spiritual progress or the power of the resurrection, the power of the Pentecost, we have to first go through a Calvary. And this Calvary we may be going through every day. This Calvary that we are going through may just be the answer to our prayer. If not for this Calvary, if not for this crucifixion and this dying, if not for Good Friday, really the beauty and power of the resurrection and Easter will not be revealed. So when we pray for patience, God is not going to put patience in a little capsule or wrap it up in a beautiful box and send it down to us. He is going to give us opportunities to practice that patience, which is already within us. When we pray for wisdom, he's going to give us choices and opportunities. Some may be very stressful, some very painful and unbearable. 
we know that sometimes we have to make those decisions. Some may be foolish decisions, some may be wise decisions, but God always gives us these opportunities of practical lessons of whatever we learn, he will give us a test. He will allow us to go through that test and to practice it and to master it. Let us pray friends that each of us and the church world over may understand may understand the principles of the kingdom may understand the principles of prayer god has already answered our prayer many of us have learned how to pray and we, we're going to thank god for the many blessings that he has poured out into our lives giving us resilience giving us such great power giving us insight into our struggles what we ought to do how we ought to pray we thank god for all that he's doing for us in our lives today amen our father who art in heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thy will be done on earth as in heaven give us this day our daily bread forgive us our trespasses as, as we forgive those who trespass against us lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy, Holy Mary, Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now, now and at the hour of our death. death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now, now and at the hour of our death. death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy, Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy, Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as, as it was in the beginning, beginning is now, now, and ever shall be, the world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of your mercy. Mary, Queen of the Most Holy Rosary, Pray for us. The fifth glorious mystery, the coronation of Mother Mary. We pray for all the intentions that have come to the missionaries of prayer. We want our prayers to be answered immediately. We want our problems to be solved quickly. We don't want any dis discomfort to come into our lives. In fact, we don't want to deal with no for an answer. We don't want denials, but yet we admire someone who has been through the fire. We admire people who have the ability to respond positively and sensitively and charitably to tough situations. People whom we admire and look up to and wish we could be like them are all ordinary people who have been through troubled waters, who have been through terrible fires, but have taken the trouble to learn the word of God and to learn the principles of the kingdom of God. But often what we are left with is just admiration. 
and not the firm resolve or the will to do what they did in their life. Today, friends, let us pray, all of us together, we, we pray and we thank God because we believe that whatever we have prayed for in faith, we have already received it. I'm sure many of us are struggling in this area where we have only admiration towards people who are living strong lives. We are going to pray and give thanks to the Lord, believing that God has answered our prayer, that we will not just look at somebody else and admire their resilience and how they use the word of God and how they've learned to pray. But we're going to thank God for giving us the grace, this grace to learn how to pray, to learn the principles of the kingdom of God. We thank God for moving powerfully in our lives, for bringing change and transformation in our lives, for answering all of our prayers and for manifesting, for allowing all of it to be manifested for us to experience and enjoy now and today. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed by the name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst men, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst men, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst men, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst men, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst men, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst men, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst men, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst men, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst men, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst men, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, the world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of your mercy. Mary, Queen of the Most Holy Rosary, pray for us. Communion. My Jesus, I believe that you are present in the Most Holy Sacrament. I love you above all things, and I desire you into my soul. Since I cannot at this moment receive you sacramentally, Come at least spiritually into my heart. I embrace you as if you were already there and unite myself wholly to you. Never permit me to be separated from you. Amen. Closing prayer. Sweet Mother Mary, I offer thee the spiritual communion to bind up bouquets in the wreath to place upon thy brow. O oh my mother, I come to you today with all the prayers and intentions of every brother and sister who pray this most holy rosary today and lift their burdens along with mine to thee. Holy Mother of God, you have never turned away your children who have sought your help and intercession. Look with favor upon our gifts. 
and in thy great love obtain for us these graces. Amen. Litany of the Blessed Virgin Mary. Lord, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, hear us. Christ, hear us. God, the Father of heaven. Have mercy on us. God, the Son, Redeemer of the world. Have mercy on us. God, the Holy Spirit. Have mercy on us. Holy Trinity, one God. Have mercy on us. Holy Mary. Pray for us. Holy Mother of God. Pray for us. Holy Virgin of Virgins. Pray for us. Mother of Christ. Pray for us. Mother of Divine Grace. Pray for us. Mother Most Pure. Pray for us. Mother Most Chaste. Pray for us. Mother Inviolate. Pray for us. Mother Undefiled. Pray for us. Mother Most Amiable. Pray for us. Mother Most Admirable. Pray for us. Mother of Good Counsel. Pray for us. Mother of our Creator. Pray for us. Mother of our Savior. Pray for us. Mother of Mercy. Pray for us. Mother of Hope. Pray for us. Virgin Most Prudent. Pray for us. Virgin Most Venerable. Pray for us. Virgin Most Renowned. Pray for us. Virgin Most Powerful. Pray for us. Virgin Most Merciful. Pray for us. Virgin Most Faithful. Pray for us. Mirror of Justice. Pray for us. Seat of Wisdom. Pray for us. Cause of our Joy. Pray for us. Spiritual Vessel. Pray for us. Vessel of Honor. Pray for us. Singular Vessel of Devotion. Pray for us. Mystical Rose. Pray for us. Tower of David. Pray for us. Tower of Ivory. Pray for us. House of Gold. Pray for us. Ark of the Covenant. Pray for us. Gate of Heaven. Pray for us. Morning Star. Pray for us. Health of the Sick. Pray for us. Refuge of Sinners. Pray for us. Comfort of the Afflicted. Pray for us. Comfort of Migrants. Pray for us. Help of Christians. Pray for us. Queen of Angels. Pray for us. Queen of Patriarchs. Pray for us. Queen of Prophets. Pray for us. Queen of Apostles. Pray for us. Queen of Martyrs. Pray for us. Us. Queen of Confessors, pray pray for us. Queen of Virgins, pray pray for us. Queen of All Saints, pray pray for us. Queen conceived without original sin, pray pray for for us. Queen assumed into heaven, pray pray for us. Queen of the Most Holy Rosary, pray pray for us. Queen of Peace, pray pray for us. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world, spare us, the Lord. Lord. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Gracious to hear us, the Lord. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. Grant we beseech thee, O Lord God, that we thy servants may enjoy perpetual health of mind and body, and by the glorious intercession of the blessed Mary, ever virgin, be delivered from present sorrow and enjoy eternal happiness through Christ our Lord. Amen. Friends, let us pray for uh, this wonderful family who anchored the uh, rosary today. We believe and we pray with faith. Thank you, Lord, for moving powerfully in the lives of Renu, Lisa, Rihanna, and Rina. Thank you, Lord, for the thirst to study the word of God and for giving them the grace to experience your victory in their lives. Amen. We will all bow down and receive a priestly blessing from Father Benedict. Father, you have to unmute yourself. Yeah. Okay. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Lord, teach us to offer you a heart of thanksgiving, and also be patient in all our daily experiences of life. Teach us to be joyful always, to pray continually, and to give thanks and be patient in all our circumstances. We make this prayer through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen.